this is a story for all ages about an orphan who turned himself into an American folk hero. The index we are officially in a danger blasting zone here for heading out to the top of Crazy Horse. So there's no stopping, no turning around. We are heading to the top. I'm Allison. That's baby Chloe. And I'm Andrew. Hi, I'm Kiara. Hi, I'm Yelena. We are a family of five traveling and adventuring on our national adventure. Come join us as we find beauty through simplicity. It is pretty huge. It's a story for all ages and offers a glimpse into this most inspiring project. It's a story about an orphan who taught himself how to sculpt and became an American folk hero. We made it to Crazy Horse and we had a private tour to go to the very top right out onto his arm. Hey, <laughs> we're walking past the sign. We're breaking the rules. We tried to get a little hat for Chloe, but apparently there's none that fit her. So, we're gonna just have to be super careful. Okay, we're going clear up on top of the arm from pretty much just right below the chin, clear out to about where his wrist would be. Hey, we're all in the van. Mom's up front. <laughs> hey, Mom. Hi. You guys, look, you guys look like professional construction workers. Yeah. In the middle. You are? You're kind of in the caboose? No, I'm from Pittsburgh. We're, we're getting the bumpy. We love bumps. Yeah? Bumpy, bumpy. Bumpy, bumpy. Bumpy, bumpy. Bumpy, bumpy. We store explosives there for a couple days prior to the blast. And when there's explosives there, there's a member of the mountain crew stays there overnight. So he camps out with them. The we are officially in a danger blasting zone here for heading out to the top of Crazy Horse. So there's no stopping, no turning around. We are heading to the top. And we're here. We're here. So their tradition is that you walk out onto the arm and everyone turns around and looks at the face at once. The visitor center is about three-fourths of a mile away from the carving. And the mountain crew actually works year round on the current phase of the carving, removing most of the rock, labor let by labor, intensive drilling and feathering and wedging of the granite. The, the face took 50 years to complete the face. Yeah. In reference to Rushmore, how long did it take? How, how long did it take Rushmore versus? Well, here's, here's the differences Rushmore carved faces on a mountain. We're carving the entire mountain. The four faces of Rushmore would pretty much fit in the back side of Crazy Horse's head. And eventually we're going to have a head on an Indian on a horse. The original sculptor created a model in the, uh, in the studio. And for every inch on the model, you do 32 or 34 inches on the mountain. Our tour guide was awesome and gave us some great information about Crazy Horse while the girls just had some fun playing in the shadows of, of Crazy Horse right there on the arm. Little finger, this is the ring finger, oh and this is the little pinky finger. Oh my. Oh, now, to get this real smooth cut, we use this diamond tip cable saw. Korzak was born in Boston of Polish descent, endured a difficult upbringing, and became a self-taught, renowned sculptor. Gaining recognition at the 1939 World Fair, 
he attracted the attention of Chief Henry Standing Bear, who invited Korzak to the Black Hills to carve Crazy Horse. Korzak and his wife had 10 children. They were dedicated to the management and staff, and his children and grandchildren carry on the project today. to go mess up his hair before we leave and you can tell everybody at your school that you went and messed up crazy horse's hair messed up crazy horse's hair kiara you want to go mess up crazy horse's hair want to go mess up crazy horse's hair apparently they wanted to pick his nose instead oh two million crystals you see there are a lot of shiny rocks here. This is mica. Okay. How much mica is around here? Fair amount, it looks Everything. to me like. I mean, it's everywhere. Carvers use a diamond wire rock saw to complete several cuts at different angles and directions. And the heat that they use melts away, creating sort of a softer appearance on the monument itself. It's such a vast difference from the original beginning jagged rock that they start with. So, that's it when the workers go all the way to the top. Uh, we've gone as high as we can go for today, right, Chloe? Yeah. All the way to the top. Wow! The billy goats are kind of like at home here at Crazy Horse. They roam the sides of the hills and on the actual monument itself. So much fun to see the goats just as we left. Here's the thing about the Crazy Horse monument. Visitors, anybody who comes is actually part of the history. This is not a government paid monument. This is a monument that is strictly being created and crafted from donations. And it's one of the largest monuments in the United States history, carved out of the granite and rock. So it is a huge undertaking. If you wanted to help, if you wanted to donate, you can donate to the Crazy Horse Memorial Foundation and it's a tax deductible donation. Yeah, we found the gift shop. After a really cool tour, we're checking out all the artifacts, and Chloe is just. I know she Super excited to see all the really cool things. That looks like a really cool book. Here on the property, there's actually an old schoolhouse. All the kids back in the day, they would go to school in that building. They created a gate that was covered with tons of beautiful animals. These animals were all the animals that you could find here in the hills or throughout the property, either now or throughout the ages that the children drew pictures of. And then they created a beautiful fence for. Sculptor left a living legacy. It's a legacy that's still in progress, a legacy that's still being created today. We'll eventually get it done, just not this week. It takes several decades for sure. And nobody can tell me what kind of technology we're gonna have in 40 or 50 years. So, you know, maybe it'll take 100 years or maybe 50 years from now they'll figure out a way to do it in the weekend. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you hit like, subscribe, and hit that button so that you can stay updated for all future videos. We'll see you later. I won't make it easy for you now. You got two minutes of my time. Slip into your dreams tonight. Oh, so give me, so give me your all. I'll take it, I'll take it to Mars. Oh, I'll stick like glue inside your mind. Just.
watch me breaking. 